Okay, we're getting to the latter part of October, and that means the Houston Astros are in the ALCS, and this year they're playing the Boston Red Sox, and here lately they've been eating Boston's lunch. So what does Boston have for lunch? Boston baked beans, of course, and we're gonna show you how to make them Astro style. They're red hot. Okay, we're gonna start this off using either a, a cast iron skillet or a Dutch oven or a large skillet if you don't have cast iron. But uh, we're gonna put in four diced up slices of Canadian bacon on high heat. So we wanna brown this. Okay, once you've got some good color in that Canadian bacon, the way you like it, turn the heat down to medium and we're gonna add half a diced onion. I used yellow onion, it's a little sweeter than the white, but it's the cook's choice, and the recipe calls for a half a bell pepper, two diced jalapeno peppers. If you don't want it too hot, you can uh, core the seeds out of them, but I'm making it Astro style, red hot, seeds and all. Now we're gonna get this going for about five minutes or so. The onions and peppers start softening. And I added just a little bit of cooking oil to help this out, just a tiny bit. Okay, the onions and the peppers, we're sauteing these on medium heat, and we wanna just go till they soften. Okay, once everything is sauteed to perfection, it's time to add your beans. Now we're gonna put in three 16 ounce cans and you can use baked beans, navy beans, or great northern beans. It's your choice. I decided to use two cans of baked beans and one can of great northern. I love the great northern beans. But you wanna put in the juice and all. Next, we're adding one half cup of brown sugar. Okay, I'm using two tablespoons of red wine vinegar. Apple cider vinegar is perfectly fine if you choose to use that. One tablespoon of ketchup. Two teaspoons of Dijon mustard. One fourth cup of barbecue sauce of your choice. I use the world's number one barbecue sauce, SBR, Sweet Baby Ray's Original. Okay, now we need one half teaspoon of garlic powder. Now I'm gonna add half a teaspoon of jalapeno powder, cause why? It's Houston Astro style, red hot. And the last thing, I've got one teaspoon of umame powder. It's made from shiitake mushroom, umame powder. You can get it from Amazon. And now we're gonna give it a stir, but you don't wanna over stir your beans, but you do wanna get your stuff mixed. Okay, you want your beans to come to a good uh, bubble. I'm gonna turn the heat off. All right, I'm putting six slices of smoked maple bacon. And this is fairly thin. If you get too thick, you might have trouble cooking it properly. And in the meantime, I'm preheating my grill to 325 degrees. Now you can cook these in the oven, but I've got a Kamado and I'm gonna, uh, got a temperature controller on the Kamado. I'm bringing it up to 325, and then I'm gonna set this in there for two to four hours. We'll probably shoot for three hours. For the final hour, we're gonna take the lid off. Okay, I'm ready to give them a try. They're absolutely delicious. They've got some back end heat, but go Astros. As you can see, that's a great recipe for Boston baked beans, but it may be a little too hot for some people, so all you gotta do is cut back on that jalapeno and it'll be just right for you. Please hit that like button, it's free. Hit that subscribe button, that's also free. And I hope to see you next time at Paul Daddy's Blind Hog Barbecue. Thanks for watching.